like that. Hey everybody, welcome to the Old Dog Farm. Today we ran this limb saw. It's a game changer, so I'll show you all about it once I get cleaned off. It's uh, springtime and hot here in the south. You can see all the dust uh, sticks to me. It doesn't blow off, so I'm gonna go get cleaned up and I'll show you all about it. Well, there's our uh, limb saw that we bought. We got it at Lowe's, it's a cobalt brand. And this thing is just amazing. So I thought I'd put my old pole pruner up next to it so you could see. Hopefully this is the last time I ever even touch this thing. After using the limb saw, I'm not even sure I could give that sucker away. So I was pulling on the branch, trying to get the right leverage. And then instead you get this eight inch uh, chainsaw action, which is amazing. And uh, this thing is just super simple. It's battery operated. So it's really, really easy to operate. And I'm gonna eject the, first of all, you can check the battery life just by pressing this button. And I used it so much that I think it's dead. But uh, you push that button and it'll tell you. And then you just click this and it pops the battery out. That's what the battery looks like. And then I'll go uh, put it on the charger here in a minute. Okay, there's the battery charger right above my workbench. And I just take the battery, slide it in, get a connection, and there you can see it charging. It's just that simple. And it has tons and tons of power, so you know there's no concerns there. You don't have to worry about that. So I'll go ahead and put the battery in for a second. Um, really easy to operate. You can see there the the unlock, or you can lock it so you know that it's not going to start trimming on you. And it's got double double toggles, so you hit both of those toggles and it'll run. In fact, let me. Plenty of power, really easy to operate. It comes in three sections, and you just get the it, more than the, what took more than anything is getting the three pieces aligned. But you just join them together, the fastener to this arrow that you see here, and then you tighten these handles. And these things will get loose when you operate it. So if it stops operating all of a sudden, just uh, go ahead and check and tighten these things up, and they work just fine. Now let's take a look at the head of it. First thing you'll notice is it uses bar oil. So you just pop it open and pop the bar oil in there. And that thing is empty because I used it for a good 45 minutes today, just cutting stuff like crazy and uh, completely emptied it. So time for some more bar oil. And then it is a typical chainsaw setup have here so you can see that eight inch bar with the chain and then I'm gonna loosen this black knob here so you can see what it looks like inside but you adjust it just like you do any other chainsaw so I opened that up and you can see well there's a leaf you can see the the chainsaw itself there, the bar, the drive pulley, looks just like any other chainsaw. It's just small and it's uh, battery operated. But this thing is a beast. It just goes through anything that you could want it to go through. So I'd highly recommend getting it. Yeah. 